Gotta go. You gotta see things. See new faces and brand new things. Gotta go places and do things. Maybe to forget. <laughs> Good morning. So today's vlog starts with me and Stu going across to Spider-Man's allotment to salvage a load of scrap metal which we are going to bring back to life and turn into all sorts of fantastic looking things for the pub, including light fittings. Well, it's like me over to the screen, me over to the paper through. He always just catch me like, What's up, buddy? I like to come up at you from behind, mate. That's the truth. <laughs> so, uh, we nipped up to Spider's a this morning, picked up some uh, of the trash that was burnt. It's not trash, really. All the ironwork and everything that was burnt in the fire that he had uh, a couple of months ago. And a lot of it is uh, raw iron steel tools that kind of stuff so i'm going to salvage it and turn it into some type of light fitting this is a little bit of a rundown of what we've got you can see all these spades that got uh, torched essentially some tools a bit of chain chicken feed this tackle here not the scales but this uh, little i don't know what you call it trailer thing and then i've taken a lot of the uh, a lot of the metallic pieces and popped them in what's left of today's caustic that we use to clean the casks. I'm hoping that this will bring a lot of this rust, this surface rust off and uh, allow me to get down to bare metal and do some welding with them and get them attached onto some pieces of wood. Fingers crossed. So we've got a bit of an experiment going really. So this is uh, Cosgleam, which is basically sodium hydroxide with um, what's it called now? Hyperchlorate in there. And then on here we've got the muriatic acid doing its job on a pair of snips. That looks like it's really working. And then over here we've got another few trials. Straight sodium hydroxide. Seems to be fetching a bit of the rust off. Persid, which is basically paracetic acid doing nothing really. And then we've got um, caustic soda which as you can see is fizzing a bit so I think that's going to be the champ either that or this so we shall come back to it tomorrow and examine the pieces <laughs> but now it's uh, poet's day isn't it but so Piss off early tomorrow Saturday that's it we've got to fire away oh and also uh, there was an electrical short in the gent toilets tripping everything huh? turned out to be a PIR sensor. We uh, found it, it was all burnt to a crisp, but we've taken it down. I've basically just bridged it with some uh, of these Wago blocks. 
these little bad boys if you've seen them I think you've probably seen them before uh, and we'll put a new one in next week but that's it I'm gonna clear off Froggy I'm gonna food pull fucking casks again yes Froggy's been casking today Jesus. and washing the walls by the I'm looks of it the walls, yeah. Look at that bad boy. Hey, you've got a, you've got a powerful stream on you, buddy. I know, I know. <laughs> I, used to, I used to do that at school, in at junior school. So you could get ice up the wall. Yeah, you remember those? You're right. It just used to be a wall for gents where yeah. we were for boys, yeah. and you just stand around back at the wall and pee. Yeah. Piss all over the walls. Yeah, and they would try and wee over the top all the time. Anyway, that's it, folks. I'm going to wrap it up now. Uh, pop in tomorrow to see what I do on a Saturday. Probably not a lot. Uh, but other than that, I'm off. See you later. Yeah.